Before we start drawing, we're going to do a little warm-up exercise for our fingers, our wrists, our elbows and our shoulders. Start off with some spirit fingers and then we're going to clench and open our hands. For our wrists, we'll start with some big circles in one direction and then in the opposite direction. For our elbows, we're going to start with small circles in one direction, getting gradually bigger and bigger, and then we're going to reverse the direction, getting gradually smaller and smaller. For our shoulders, we're going to shrug them up to our ears once, twice, three times and then finish with some big circles with our arms in one direction and then back in the opposite direction. Our first warm-up exercise for drawing is just going to be doing some scribbles. So with any pen or pencil that you like, just start a line on the page going wherever you want to go. See what it feels like to not move your wrist and just move your fingers. And then add your wrist in and continue the line. And when you're ready, add your elbow in and then your shoulder as well to make some big circles. Keep on going with this one long continuous line until you've evenly filled up all the spaces on the page. You might like to do some spirals, or you might like to do some squares with some pointy corners. You might like to do little waves or big waves changing direction. And then once you've filled up all the corners and all the spaces, and when your shoulder and your elbow, your wrist and your fingers are feeling nice and loose and warm, we're ready to move on to the next one. Our next warm up exercise is going to be drawing circles. We want to draw big circles, small circles, tiny circles, medium circles, and fill up the whole page or the whole box that you're using. Remember to make use of your fingers, your wrists, your elbow and your shoulder while you're drawing the circles. And we're aiming for a nice, single, continuous, unbroken line with the circles where you can't quite tell where it starts and ends. If you've just started and you're not very good at circles yet, you might like to go around a few times to try and get the shape like that. Okay, our second drawing warm-up exercise is just to practice drawing some lines. Going from left to right, making sure we're using 
our elbow and our shoulder. Do your best to draw a nice straight continuous line. It might wobble a little bit or it might go off course. That's all right, keep going. Once you've filled up your box or your page, switch to a different colour marker and see if you can trace the lines you made exactly the same as the first time. Okay. Our third warm-up drawing exercise is to create a diamond pattern. So starting with lines at a 45 degree angle, we're going to fill up our box or our page. We want each of the lines to be a nice even distance apart and nice and straight. Once you've done your first set of lines, we're going to do 45 degree lines in the opposite direction, trying our best to make all of the edges meet up with each other. All right, now the first row, we're going to use vertical lines to fill in each diamond shape. And then every second row, we're going to use horizontal lines to fill in each diamond shape. Making sure that we're leaving one blank diamond in between both of the rows. Okay. 